River State Governor Nyesun Wiki has responded to the 48-hour automatum given to him by members of the Social Cultural Organization of the Ijo Nation to release House of Representatives member Honorable Farah Dagogo. A federal lawmaker representing Degema and Boni in the House of Representatives, Dagogo was allegedly arrested on Governor Wiki's order last week for allegedly disrupting the screening of governorship aspirants of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, in Port Harcourt. He was said to have been arrested alongside orders and ordered to be remanded in police custody by a magistrate court in the state. The River State Governor had earlier declared that Gogo wanted for allegedly hiring courts to attack the People's Democratic Party, PDP, sectorate in Port Harcourt. In a statement titled, Arrest of Honorable Farah Dagogo, political persecution of an Ijo son and released over the weekend. The Ijo National Congress, through its president, Professor Benjamin Okaba, called for his immediate release from incarceration within 48 hours in the interest of peace, justice and fairness, insisting that the charges levelled against him were bailable. However, while speaking at a church program on Sunday, May 8, Governor Winke said, the Ijo youth do not know who they are dealing with. He stated that instead of them coming to peacefully ask what happened, they are issuing an ultimatum. Thunder fired them and the ultimatum, Winke said. Now that brings us to also where some people say we are Ijo Youth Congress, we are Ijo National Congress, threatening government. You are wasting your time. I'm not, I don't know why people don't even know who they are dealing with. Me, me, threatening me, 48 hours. Instead of you to come to government, what is the problem? What happened? Into threatening government, ultimatum. Under fire you and ultimatum. You look at me. You see, our people 